Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Conan Exiles. Alrighty, when we left off, I did not have these daggers. Um, in my own personal file, I'd been messing around with daggers a little bit, and uh, I kind of like them. So I made these Namidian poniards here. They kind of sit just like normal daggers. Lunge attacks right there. And these cause bleed, except for the last swing there, which causes a cripple. I kind of wanted to try them out with this character, see how well it works out. Um, found out a uh, another issue with uh, <laughs> the way the thing was set up, but that's we, we won't go into that. That will be an embarrassing uh, outtake later um <laughs> that is for reggie's eyes only but anyway let's try out these new daggers on the crocodile here which looks to be a normal sized crocodile which means not murderous in any way Whoop, okay there we go now I didn't really let the bleed effect play out all that much with that one. So you guys probably didn't notice the benefit of bleed. But as the name would suggest, it is very useful. So, especially when you're trying to defeat a singular opponent and uh, they're rather tough. So let's heal up a little bit. It was a little damaged from earlier um, in the outtake part that will not be shown in this episode. Uh, but it is embarrassing. Let's just leave it at that, shall we? All right. So, the other thing I can make, which I should, is an iron sickle. And the reason why I'm making that is because... Iron Sickle will allow me to get a whole lot of different materials a lot faster. Craft an iron tool. Yep. Which is what the sickle is for. Now it will allow me to collect these far quicker. And far more of them. As you noticed. We got like... We were sitting at 20. What are we sitting at now? 45. So we got 25 off of two swings. And that's not to mention all the handfuls of bugs that are also coming out because we're doing that. Pretty useful. Pretty useful. So I can drop more of those in there as we're collecting quite a bit of fish there. And how's my iron doing? Oh, made another 60. Perfect. And with that done... Put that in there, and we'll make more tools. Particularly, the iron pick to replace what I currently got. And the iron hatchet. Oh, I need more branches. That's what my problem is. I see. That would make it a little difficult. <laughs> I will fix that. But, might as well try these on human opponents, shall we? We got, looks like two guys. Yeah, it looks like two guys. Oop, didn't hit it all. Oh, come on. Okay, well. Okay, well. Time for combat. Get back away from him. And, yep. Well, I don't think any of them wanted to be here. And down you go. Good. See? On one and one combat arenas like that, works out beautifully. And that is a volatile gland. Bizarre gland that can be used to make explosives. Well, I don't see why we won't do that. 
So I'm gonna grab that. And I'm also, whoops. <laughs> I'm also going to do that, because I need a little bit of healing. A little bit. And there we go. We're good. And we throw these in there to make more putrid meat to then make more compost with. And with this needing a lot more of that, we'll do that. And grinder wise, how what am I doing? Just two. I got two left of those. Ooh. Well, that's not good. Uh, we'll put that here. And now uh, we'll do like 54. There we go. So we're down to 50 on that. And then, how's our... I keep pressing the wrong buttons. What I meant to do was look at our arrows. Our arrows are looking fine. We'll just throw these in there and call that good. Yeah, perfect. And now I can make the pickaxe and axe that I was intending on doing. And we will eventually, actually we should, just get rid of that shield entirely because there's no need for it anymore. Because the daggers are all we're going to need for a long time. Now, I got another level, but I want to get rid of this first. There we go. Put that there. Fantastic. And we shall put this in there to make more leather. Fantastic. Can't complain about that. Uh, I could, however, get some more of that. Um... I'm sitting at 118, so 82 should do it. There we go. Fantastic. The hide is fine. We'll leave that there. And we just need to get more iron now. So, again, we go forward. But, we'll do it with the new tools we have just made. We will replace old. That's not what I wanted, <laughs> but it's fine. I guess we could rearrange a little bit. There we go. Put that there and put that there. Actually, you know what? Screw it. I'm going to take all of these. Put that there. And I'm going to toss at least the sword into the water. <laughs> because there's no reason to hold on to it. I keep hitting that button when I don't mean to. These we don't need to hold on to because they're all just stone. There's no reason to try and break them down. And we swim. We swim across the river to get more iron. Now the downside with these daggers is that against those rock nose enemies, they aren't actually that effective because rock noses aren't affected by bleed but virtually every other enemy is so I have no reason to complain really all that much about the fact that it doesn't work on the rock noses because quite frankly their attack speed is still enough to make them viable against them at least for now I don't want to end up accidentally hitting the babies. I'd feel bad. Alright. So. Whoop. And. There we go. Managed to work. I was hoping it would. Okay. There's that. One down. And it also seems to work as a decent stunner as well. At least against the hyenas. And back up. The bleed took them out. Fantastic. Now... <laughs> I have a feeling that I shouldn't 
bother trying to get the skin since I already have plenty of leather. But I want to see if I can get bones out of them. Not entirely sure if I can. It doesn't seem like I can at all. Yeah, it doesn't seem to work at all. I don't need the uh, feral flesh either. I keep hitting the wrong buttons. So that and that I'm going to drop because I'm only here for iron. And bones was really all what I was hoping as a side thing. Look at that. I got 36 already. Half of my last take. And I already have... Well, I wouldn't say half. It was more like a third. But still, a third of my last take. And I got it like that. Okay. And the bleed took care of the rest of it for me. You see why I love these daggers? You see why? Plus, you can poison them later on as well, which is, you know, even more amazing. And let's see if I can get bones out of you. I can! Beautiful. That's all I needed. That's literally all I needed. Now... And try to take that one down as much as possible. And the stun is actually kind of useful here. I gotta admit. Apparently, the last attack also does a stack of bleed, and I wasn't aware of that. I'm fine with that. Don't get me wrong. I wasn't aware of it. And they don't have anything, so I'm not going to bother. But I am going to pull this and this out. Because I'm going to need the light as I'm getting more iron here. <laughs> so there's going to be a ton of it. Actually, you know what? Might as well try and take you out. Oh, Jesus. He moved just so I was trying to make the shot. But it's fine. And the bleed's gonna take it out. Yep. You see how wonderful these daggers are? <laughs> For real? I mean, come on. How? How could you deny that power? I mean, really. Alright, I'm pretty sure there's iron. There it is. I knew there was iron in this general area. I just wasn't able to find it. Alright. And I'm pretty sure I took out all the enemies that are nearby. In this general vicinity. Alright. And some more iron. Perfect. Look at how much more iron I'm collecting just by using a proper pickaxe instead of just a stone one. It's amazing. I keep hitting that button as well. That's an accident. Look at that. I'm at 135. Usually that'd be what I was hoping to get out of the entire trip. But I just collected that off of like three nodes hard to beat. It is hard to beat. The other downside <laughs> to using the poniards is when I take on an enemy, I'm going to have to drop the torch. So I'm not going to be able to see them all that well. Especially if I'm already in the shadows. Which is, you know, not ideal <laughs> in the slightest. Hey. Can't win them all, right? Okay. So I'm just kind of hoping. Oh yeah, that's another thing I can use the scythe for. Getting a lot 
of aloe and aloe seeds as well. Can't complain about that. Can't in the slightest complain about that. Alright. So, there's spiders over that way. And I know there's hyenas on the way up to that section. But I just want to get the last bits of iron and coal that I can around here. But I also know combat's going to happen and I want to make sure I'm in a place I can see them. <laughs> I just had a devious idea. What if... No. If I can hit the right buttons. What if... I do have enough... Uh, I don't have... The standing torch. Because I don't have the branches, but I could but I could. And now I do. And in fact, I could probably get more. There we go. Alright. Fantastic. And they're running. Don't know why they're running, but it's fine. Uh, now that it's light enough, I don't have to worry about it, but I do have the branches in case that does happen again. I can just make standing torches and put them around where I intend to do the combat. That's not a bad idea. It's not a bad idea. Now. Oh, there's this thing. Which will give me a lot of good stuff. At least a lot of good meat. Well, hi there, buddy. Whoa! You charged up on me real fast. I didn't expect that. But, you probably didn't expect any of this either. <laughs> and the bleed's gonna take you out. Bye bye. Alright. Oh, I should have gotten an iron. An iron one of these. Oh well. Hindsight's 2020. Exquisite meat is. I keep hitting the wrong button. <laughs> Exquisite meat is still fine. I could have used that head as leather. Nah, I don't need it. I have plenty of other things giving me enough leather to worry about. Alrighty. So. Got a hyena here. What? what? Where did you run in from? That was surprising. There we go. Leave and take care of the rest. And there we go. Back up. Okay. And there we go. I've gained two levels. I should probably put those points <laughs> where they ought to go. Um, putting some points into agility wouldn't be terrible. And some in grit would be good too. Oh, now I have putrid meat. I keep hitting the wrong button. I'm pretty sure I got that from that. Yeah, I got it from that. It's fine. It's fine. No worries. Well, hi there. Okay. Uh, we got that. There we go. The fact that it disappeared was kind of funny. <laughs> Okay, and spider would be up there. I see it. I see it. I keep hitting the wrong buttons. Why do I keep doing that to myself? Okay, it's fine. It's fine. I'm going to make more bandages because it's easy. And it's time to make a shot on a spooter. It's not even moving. I found that hilarious. I was making attacks on a spider. I wasn't even making attacks back. Okay. Okay. As long as I'm doing decent amounts of damage and inflicting bleeds, it should be fine. 
Okay. Some of the attacks are not actually hitting, and that's annoying. But the bleed did it. The bleed did it. That's all I could hope for. Okay, more chitin and more ecor. I'm fine with that. Okay. So now let's get some more coal. Because coal is always useful. The fact that it disappears. <laughs> and I got queen bees. Okay. Alright. That I didn't expect. Time to get some coal. There we go. And drink some water myself up to almost topped. There we go. Fantastic. Alright. Now, iron-wise, I don't think there's much in this area that I can work with. No, there isn't. But there is... Oh! Oh, no. I don't know if I can fight this one. I can't. I can't. It's time to... Oh! First death. First death. <laughs> you think my bed roll? <laughs> oh, my ass is just flapping in the breeze. Okay. Good thing <laughs> my bed roll is not that far away. Oh, boy. Well. <laughs> I can at least make the run back. <laughs> that shouldn't be too difficult. Oh, dear. Okay. It was worth the try, right? It was worth the try. Oh, man. So this is technically the quicker way to get over to where I went. Technically. <laughs> it's time to do the run back to get my stuff. And then hopefully get out of there as soon as possible. Actually, you know what? This... Oh, never mind. I was about to say this place isn't too bad for another home, but... uh got shale backs here that won't take too kindly to me being here. See? See what I mean? See what I mean? <laughs> I'm gonna take too kindly to me moving in. At least not here. Yep. Maybe not here, but maybe... Maybe here. It is by the river. All right. Anyway. I need to get more iron so that way I can make the armor that I can then use to not die as quickly <laughs> against those things. Which, you know, kind of useful. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um, everything has... Everything has spawned near where my body is. Uh, great. Okay. Well, I'm going to have to climb. Just to get around them. That's the only option I got. Please tell me it's not still here. It's hard to say. It looks like it is. Oh, boy. Where's my body? Where'd my body go? It should be nearby. Shouldn't be impossible to find my body. And it is. It is completely possible. Huh. Oh, joy. So now I have two things to try and avoid. And I'm going to try and sneak my way over. Very slowly. <laughs> is sneak a skill? No. But is it useful in this situation? Yes. Okay, and at least it isn't 
a murder one, like last time. Okay, this one I might be able to just do normal combat with. Okay. Oh, righty then. And since I'm here, and my body's here, I'm going to collect hide and bones off of my body. <laughs> as well as human fleth. <laughs> human fleth. Yes, I said it like that on purpose. Um, I will not be holding on to the human flesh. I shall be dropping it shortly. But <laughs> I at least have it. All right, equip a piece of light armor is the thing I will be doing soon. <laughs> Hopefully sooner than I hope. Oh, boy. Yeah. This is a big camp. And they would very much like to murderize me, I am sure. Okay. Um... Time to drop down. There we go. And time to heal up. It's a good idea, given the circumstances. Uh. And I will need to go across here to get to where iron actually is. The more iron I can get, the more armor I can make. I'm hoping to be able to make medium armor at the very least. But uh, I'll still need to make a bit of light armor for completing that part of the journey, I'm sure. Alright, so there's that. I can collect that, no problem. Cool. I'm pretty sure that is a murder. I <laughs> mean, same one that murderized me a while back, or at least the same kind. So I'm not gonna bother pissing that one off. Alright. There's the murder cave. The whole bunch of murder folks. Rather not run into them if I can avoid it. And instead, we shall just bypass them entirely. Just get a little bit more plant fiber. There we go. Perfect. And the main reason I'm getting plant fiber is because I'm going to need more healing. <laughs> I need to make more of these. Which is right there. There we go. There, I'm now fully healed up. And I'm going to also die. I'm also going to need to hurt, hit the right button, first off. But I'm also going to need to eat some food. And... Yeah, there we go. I'm now in the area that will give me a whole bunch of iron. So, might as well go ahead and get that done. These guys will not give me iron. They are just stone. But, up here, the guys are. So, since the, uh, Arrows tend to be a lot more effective on the rock noses than my daggers will be. We'll just have this out for the meantime. Alright. And... Got it. Alright. See? No bleed in the slightest, but I can still cripple. So, that 
will be my plan of attack. It also helps that apparently my daggers are able to stun it. No issue. Which, you know, is good. <laughs> it's an added bonus, if nothing else. There we go. Alright, so let's make some arrows now because I'm down to 76. There we go. Two more ought to do it. And let's make more iron ore in my inventory. Make more. Just gather more, really. <laughs> there we go. See, we're doing fine. And in fact, you know what? You know what? I am sorely tempted to start a new home base. Of course, the new home base will be a work in progress, but it wouldn't be a terrible idea, would it? There we go. Get that. The wood would be hard to gather. I'll readily admit that. But it wouldn't be difficult. Oh, look at you. Oh, you're the demon kind of one of those, aren't you? Oh, that's cool. That's good to know. Good to know that you are there. Okay. So I'm thinking... I'm thinking right around here. Shouldn't be too terrible. Oops, I'm going in the first person here. <laughs> I forgot that that's an option. Okay, so... Hmm. Yeah, right here wouldn't be terrible. I would just need a whole bunch of wood for the uh, construction. Because I have plenty of stone. <laughs> There's stone as far as the eye can see. I don't think I'm going to have an issue with stone. If anything, the issue I will have is wood. But it shouldn't be a insurmountable issue. Also, what's that on top of there? can't say I've ever been there. I kind of want to know. Okay. So, yeah. I'm thinking we'll make... We'll make a little home here. So, first things first, before I do any of that, I will make... Oh, I don't have enough wood already. Crap. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> that kind of puts a damper on the whole idea now, don't it? Um, hmm. What if I do normal stone? Yeah, I can make at least one sandstone foundation. Yeah, just one. Just one. And what I will do is I will build it right here. I will raise it a little bit. And place it here. Yeah. Yeah, that ain't terrible. I might change my mind or might raise it up a little further, but yeah, that ain't terrible. This isn't a terrible spot. I just need a lot more wood. A lot more wood. But, that's an issue for another time. Because as of right now, what I need to do is head back home to the current home. And... Oh yeah, that's right. There's wood right here. I just need to take out the stone guys. But there's wood, plenty of it, right here. That ain't too bad. That ain't too bad an idea.
That ain't too bad an idea at all. Alright. So, now we head home. <laughs> the music changed. Interesting. Alright. I wasn't expecting a music change. Alright. Got a plan. Is it a good plan? Well, I'd say so, but then again, I'd say most of my plans are good plans. And nine times out of ten, I'm wrong. So, <laughs> there's that. But yeah, that ain't too bad. That ain't too bad a spot. We can get wood from down here. Yeah, this isn't too bad a spot at all. Definitely closer to the iron than my current home. By a uh, wide margin, in fact. Huh. Oh. Alright. So we head back home. We throw all of this iron in to get it all smelted down. How much did I get again? I, if it would help if I hit the right button. 263. That ain't too bad at all. Should net me a few hundred, at least. At the very least. There we go. And we will put the coal in, and the iron in, and get it started. Fantastic. And then we will throw all of this into the grinder. Good. And we will throw all of this in here, including the queen bees. Nice. Put that there. Put that there. I'm starting to get a lot of aloe. Not that that's a bad thing, but eventually I'm going to have to start doing something about it. Eventually. Alright, and this was... I had a feeling... I have to get at least one more. There we go. I'll eat that. That's not a problem at all. Okay. Useful endeavor, I'd say. What we just did. And we will be getting a lot of iron. Look at that. Look at that. Might be enough to get my first suit of armor, in fact. Well, I mean, suit of uh, medium armor, but still, nonetheless. Good. Very good. I don't know if I'm going to get this, but I know that it gives me vitality, which would be nice. Um... Maybe the Kitan Captain. Mm, maybe. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Or I might just go with the normal medium clothing. Perhaps. Just a slight bit. Eh. Either way. I'm going to need a lot of twine. Good thing I have this. To collect more fiber. Because I'm going to need a lot of it. There we go. And there's more of them over there. Interesting. Alright. I keep hitting the wrong button. I'm annoyed at myself more than anything else. Okay. That should be fine. That should be plenty of fiber. And plenty of twine for the armor I'm going to make. 
And where am I sitting on feats? Things that I can learn. I'm at 24. So I might as well... Look to see what else I can get. Answer is not a lot. <laughs> unfortunately. Uh... Yeah, terrible. Uh, not doing anything there. I might as well just close that tab permanently. Um, hmm. I'm a level away from water well, which would be what makes that new home plan of mine all work out. So I guess I'll have to work my way towards that. Other than that, I guess I should make upgrades into making stairs. I guess. Mm. I might as well make do furniture maker because it would allow me to learn some stuff. And then get the chop chop figurines. Um, learning how to do healing wraps would be nice too. And doing the large chest would be good as well. But I don't feel I have a need to get anything else really. But anyway, since I'm going to have to earn some more level ups anyway time to antagonize these folks a little bit all right nope okay ha ha time for combat ha ha well the fact that you missed me is kind of hilarious then again i also kind of missed you so I shouldn't talk. Ha ha! You walked right into that. Alright. Ooh! You already have armor. Interesting. Medium boots. Well, I can't turn that down now, can I? And that gives me that done. Medium armor completed. I don't even need to bother trying to make it yet. I can just work with what I got. And that also gives me encumbrance, right? Attributes. Yes, it gives me extra encumbrance. Good, 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 good. So with that in mind, I might just go with the medium stuff anyway. This is the normal medium stuff. Yeah, look at me. Look at me, doing good. Um, light armor. Uh, what shall I make? I keep hitting... <laughs> I keep hitting things with my controller. Uh, I keep scraping on my ring and stuff. I'm... I'm not sure what to make in the light armor category. Interesting. I'm not sure. I need the twine anyway. Okay, so time to put all of this twine in there. Alright. That'll do it. And I guess make one of those because I need to make the light armor for the thing hmm. light armor wise
I guess I can make the Aquilonian Scout headgear. That wouldn't be a terrible use of my time to get the light armor done. And then take. And I put on um, my head. I it would help if I hit the right fucking button. Ta-da! Equip a piece of light armor. Done. Oh, that looks goofy. And it gets rid of my beard. How dare. Okay, well. Not wearing that any longer than I have to. <laughs> that is for sure. All right. Just, oh, come on. Unequip. There we go. And then put that in here. Because I'm going to go for the medium, medium armor set. That said, though, I might as well complete this set for, uh, well, really, just to get it completed. So, where did those bodies go? <laughs> Where'd the bodies of my defeated enemies go? Oh, man. Oh, wait. There they are. <laughs> there they are. Alrighty. Because uh, I'm going to need some of their hide. Their bones wouldn't be a bad idea either. I don't need their flesh. Just their bones. Well, I mean... I could use the flesh. <laughs> okay. Well, I did say we were going to eventually head on to getting story stuff, and I still stand by that. We are going to still do that, but I need to make sure to have proper armor for that. So that will be what I do in the interim between this episode and the next one. So... Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat. Playing games and trying to make a lot of armor and needing a lot of iron to do it. Because the armor I want is a little on the hefty side. But it is well worth it. And hopefully I can make a set of armor for if I end up starting to recruit people. Yeah, recruit. That's the word. And uh, we'll uh, see where it goes from there. For you.